Hey guys, welcome to Homework Course. In this video, I'm going to explain you the event signal. So this is the process which I've designed to explain the event signal. Uh, here we are having a start event and a signal event and a user task and an end event. So consider this start event as people entering the hotel and consider this signal event as like people waiting for a signal to enter the dining area. And this dining area is nothing but a user activity where they are going to have the food. So once they are done with their food, then they can leave. So this is an end, end event, okay? So in the, in the start event, people will start entering the hotel with the name. So if you check the farm section here, so we are having a field name, okay? People will enter the hotel with their name and they will wait in the signal event until receiving a signal to go to the dining area. So in the dining area, like <coughs> we'll be having two keys, form keys. One is name and another one is batch ID. So this batch ID, we are not, no, we are not, uh, you know, in entering the batch ID in the start event, right? So from where we are getting this batch ID? Through signal, we are getting the batch ID, okay? So in the signal event, we'll be sending a post request through the postman tool. So this is the postman tool and uh, this is the URI to send the signal. Uh, this is the URI and this is post method, okay? So, and this is the request JSON. So here, uh, we need to send uh, two things here. One is name and another one is variables. So in the name section, you give the uh, signal name and inside the variable section, you just provide the, uh, you know, variable for which we are going to uh, send the value through the signal. So in this case, we are going to send a batch ID. Okay. So once, once, uh, once signal receives here, so then all the, uh, uh, instances available in this signal event will be moved to the dining area with the batch ID. So then here the name and the batch ID will be displayed. So once we submit it here, then all those instances will be uh, killed. Let's execute the process through uh, task list. So here click on the start process and initiate uh, one task here, process signal. I'm giving a name as name one name one entered the hotel and he'll be waiting in the signal event it's the waiting call if i refresh it one second okay one instance is waiting in the signal event so I'm going to send another person to the hotel. Name two. Now two people will be waiting in the uh, signal event. I'm going to send another one as well. Now three people will be waiting in the signal event. Yes, so now three people are waiting in the waiting hall. Now we need to send a signal with batch ID uh, to move those people to the dining area. Okay, now go to the postman tool. Now we can give the value as 001 and send the signal. Now signal has been sent. We'll check the task list now. Now all these three uh, instances should be moved to the dining area. Yes, now uh, all these three instances are moved to the uh, dining area. Now we'll check the, uh, you know, task one by one. So now we have three tasks in dining area. Click on the first one. We got name one with a batch ID 001. Completing it name 002 with a batch id 01 name 3 with a batch id 001 now we'll send another another set of you know uh, people to the hotel name 4 
name five. Name six. So now we have sent three people to the hotel and they'll be waiting in the waiting hall. Three people are waiting in the waiting hall. Now we'll send them to dining area by sending a signal. So I'm going to change the batch ID to 0002. So now all those three people should get the batch ID 002. They are sent to dining area. Three tasks are available here. We'll complete one by one. Name five, batch ID 002. Name four, batch ID 002. Name six, batch ID 002. Now all these three should be uh, terminated. Yes, nothing is available here. That's it guys. So uh, uh, the main thing is like, uh, the signal is like broadcasting. It will be, it will be, no, it will be sent to all the tasks available in this particular uh, signal event. For example, like uh, if, you are, if you are having 10 tasks waiting here, then once, once the signal is received, then all those 10 will be cleared from here. It is not uh, like, you know, uh, only for some, some particular task like that. So it is, it is applicable for all the tasks available in this event. Okay guys, thanks for watching and please do subscribe and support our channel.